All right, I'm back at the cabin, and uh, I want to finish up over here on this side of the loft. But in order to do that, there's a thin strip that runs along the top there on the uh, ceiling that I need to finish. So I've got some strips that um, are ready to be measured and cut and installed. So this is the first one. I've got my mark. I need to go make the cut and then I can get this first one installed.
All right, I've gone as far as I can go without making cuts. So I've got to start come, wrapping around the door, wrapping around the uh, loft rafters and uh, the window and this loft rafter over here. All right, I need to start wrapping around the door, so I've got to cut my excess foam from around the frame there. All right, now that I'm down to the top of the door, I can actually finish this entire section of the wall just by coming up to the door. So I think I'm gonna work on that.
right, I've been steady going down the wall and I've got to the point where I'm at my electrical boxes. So I've got a cigarette lighter connection and a USB port that needs to go right here. Okay, I've got my positive and negative that goes to the two ports. Okay, everything is good and solid. Um, I have a lighter, but uh, I didn't realize it, but it ran out of lighter fluid. So I'm gonna see if I can't uh, shrink wrap that using a torch. All right, I know this is crazy. Got to turn down as low as I can. That's all I've got, we'll see if it works. All right, looks like it worked. A little bit unconventional, but hey, use what you got, right? All right, I don't know if you can see that, but I've got my two holes marked where I need to uh, get my hole saw out. I just used uh, the cover plate as a template. And I've got my notches marked so let me go get all of these things cut and uh, we'll put this together all right I've got my two holes cut so let me get this installed hopefully they line up with the template looks like they do let me get the uh, nut off of these Okay, I'll adjust that in a minute. Okay. Now I need to spin these around the way that I want them, looks like. It reads that way. Get that horizontal. That gives me information about, about the battery. 
and it has two USB ports. Okay, this one probably doesn't matter, but just so that it looks the same as far as the... Alright, that looks good. Now I need to uh, get my screws in and then I'll be able to attach it on the other side. So let me go ahead and get those screws in. All right, I've got this mounted and uh, here are my studs on the back. Oop, let me make sure that's right. Yep, that's right. Okay, it comes with uh, two connectors already on it. So I just need to make sure I get this on the positive. See, there's positive and positive. All right, I've got tons of extra wire. I'm just gonna have to tuck that up inside. All right, I got quite a bit done. I got from that corner above the loft all the way over to there. Everything above the loft on this side, on both sides. And then down past the window, all the way up to the door, and down below those electrical outlets. I still have one more electrical outlet right there that I need to wrap around. But uh, I'm losing daylight. I've got uh, an LED light that uh, shines for a couple of minutes and then gets really dim. And uh, a lot of times it gives a strobe effect because it's LED. I think I'm gonna call, call it a night and uh, I'll get started again in the morning. But I think I'm gonna end this video here. So uh, thanks for watching.